Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. Um, I just recently did a makeup tutorial on this look that I'm wearing right now. So if you're interested, check that out. And you'll see it's the video right before this one. I just did it. Like, I don't know, I think like an hour ago. So if you're interested in knowing how to do this look that I'm wearing right now, check out check out that makeup tutorial. And the title actually says, this is my natural everyday kind of makeup um, that you could use totally for everyday or to go to work, to go to school. But in the title, it also says um, natural looking makeup slash job interview. So um, I'm not going to tell you guys about that. So you have to watch my tutorial to find out what I'm talking about. So check that out and you'll find out. Okay guys, so basically I haven't been doing any, I've been lacking, lacking, lacking in monthly favorite videos. I haven't done any because, you guys want to know the truth, it's because I've been simply forgetting. I don't know, like, I'd rather just do haul videos because when I buy something and I come home, I always remember to do it for you guys. But I don't know, like, I never, ever, I always forget to do monthly um, favorites. But anyway, a lot of you guys have been letting me know how, <coughs> sorry, a lot of you guys have been telling me that you want me to keep doing those videos, so you know what guys, whatever it is to make you happy, I'm going to keep doing those videos for you. Okay, so basically this is just a video showing you guys my top favorite beauty items, beauty products, all beauty. Um, mostly is makeup, like 80 to 90 percent is makeup, of course. You guys know I love makeup. Makeup is like, makeup is like my favorite thing out of all the beauty stuff. And yeah, so it's just a whole bunch of makeup um, and other beauty goodies that I have, like skincare and hair care stuff and other things like that. Okay, so let's just get started. Um, these are all of my top beauty favorites beauty beauty items and products so hopefully you guys will get some ideas if you guys are interested in anything that I have and if you want me to do a separate review like a more detailed review on any of these just let me know okay guys so the first thing that I am loving are these two drugstore lipsticks and these two are actually really really popular and you guys already know L'Oreal Ferris Nude this is how I actually found out about this, and I am absolutely in love with this. I found out on YouTube, and it's just, it's like the perfect creamy pink color. So, so beautiful. If you guys have not tried this, or if you've never owned one, go to the drugstore right now and pick this up, because it, it's absolutely beautiful. And I love how the pink just goes with everyone's skin tone. So this is really popular, and I know a lot of you guys use this. And Brimmel's Spotlight, um, what is this? Spotlight Beige. And I really, really love Rimmel's packaging. Oh my gosh, look how cute that is. I really love it. I think the packaging is so cute. And like purple is like my favorite color. So, and look at the little top. It has like a crown on it. And this one's just, this one's kind of like an in-between of like peachy and pink. So these are, both lipsticks are really good for everyday, for everyday wear, very wearable. So you guys know I'm also loving my, another Rimmel product that I'm also really liking, um, that I've been using a lot, is my Stay Matte Powder. Um, I really love this. Um, it's really sheer, but it does provide coverage, it's like medium coverage, and it really controls my, sh um, it really controls shine. And it has, it's, oh, and I really like it too because it's matte. It has no shimmers and it's matte coverage and it lasts pretty long. And I'm in the color Sandstorm. And my EOS lip balm, um, I've been using this in forever and it lasts me, it lasts you a really long time because the lip, the, the lip balm is kind of like in a ball kind of shape, but as you see, mine is like totally flat. So... I'm definitely done with this. I have to pick up a new one. But I really love this lip balm. I really love the unique shape. Like, I think this is so unique. I really love their packaging. No other lip balm came out with packaging like this. 
So, yeah, I have to get a new one, but I use this almost every day for my lips. So, I'm also loving my Revlon Photo Ready Foundation. And I really love this. And I'm in the color Rich Ginger. And as I said, um, I think in one of my tutorials I talked about this. But I really love this because it it's called Photo Ready. So it's really good for pictures and it has it's complete coverage and it just makes your skin look really airbrushed. And I love that it's creamy and it's easy to blend and it didn't break me out. And it's pretty good coverage too. Okay, and another product that I really am in love with is my e.l.f. Contouring Blush and Bronzing Powder Zero. And I know a lot of you guys love this too. And I really, oh, this is from their studio line. Um, usually e.l.f. products are like a dollar, but their studio line is like three dollars or something. And I absolutely love the packaging. The packaging is just like NARS. The NARS is like a bazillion like dollars. Um, this is really, they kind of copied NARS packaging, and this is like the same exact look of the NARS Laguna and Orgasm Duo. But that one's like 40 bucks, and this was only $30 from the studio line. And I really love this. Um, it has this huge mirror, and it just has the blush on this side and the bronzer on this side. And it's really, really pigmented. And the blush is it's a little bit shimmery, but actually both of them are a little bit shimmery, but it's not too, too shimmery with, you know, glittery and stuff like that. But I really like it. It's like a peachy pink color. It's a little bit kind of like orgasm, just a little bit. So I'm also loving my Palmer's Cocoa Butter um, Massage Lotion for Stretch Marks. Um, so far, I've only been using this for, I don't know, I have no idea. I think almost a week, but I haven't, I haven't been using it long enough to tell you guys about regarding results. I haven't really seen any results yet because I have to wait probably like a whole month. Or I'm just going to finish the whole thing. But I haven't been using it for a long time. So late, um, all I can really say about it is so far I really like how it feels on my skin. And it's very moisturizing. So the stretch marks, I'll let you guys know how that works out later on. <sighs> Why am I talking like that? Sorry. Oh my gosh, I just dropped something. I'm sorry if I sound a little bit scratched. I think I'm getting sick. So I'm also really loving these, I talked about this in my other haul video, my Revlon Lashes. And I told you guys when I do a giveaway, I'm going to um, give you guys some of these too. For my next giveaway, when I do a makeup giveaway. And I really love these lashes because they make your eyes look really flirty. And it just adds, it just kind of adds like a dramatic feel to your eyes. And they're really good for going out. And I, what I really love about it too is it's not too dramatic quite natural looking too. And my Pond's Cold Cream, um, which deep cleans and removes makeup. I'm really, so you can't even see that. See this light. I don't know if you guys can see this, but I really love this. Um, it's totally moisturizing on my eyes and my face, and it really does remove makeup really good. And I kind of just wipe it off with like a cotton pad or like a tissue or something and this is really good it even removes mascara waterproof eyeliner everything so i'm also loving my mac blush and blunt you guys know i use this all the time for contouring it's a blush but i really love it because it's just a matte dark brown it's perfect for contouring so i really really like this um, usually for contouring, I mostly just use two bronzers, um, so either this one or my NYC, um, NYC Smooth Skin, and what color is that? NYC Smooth Skin and Sunny. So I really love this for contouring, and I don't use it as a blush. So the next one is my Hard Candy um, Bronzer in Hula Hula. That's the name, as you guys can see. And I picked this up at Walmart, and this is like my second hard candy item. I really love it. It's like a bronzy, shimmery, 
bronzing powder, which has a little bit of gold, golden coppery reflex in it. So I really like this. So you guys know I talk about this, like I already made like a bazillion videos about my hard candy camouflage. I have a separate review video for this, if you guys want to check that out. Um, I just, I'm sorry I keep talking about this, I already mentioned this and showed it to you guys in like all my freaking videos already. I just love this, so that's all I'm going to say. I love it, the best concealer ever, my favorite one, favorite beauty item that I have right now, favorite makeup item I mean. Okay, so I'm also really loving my next jumbo pencil. I love um all of the jumbo pencils, but I specifically love this one, black color, because I always do smoky eyes, especially when I go out on the weekend. So this is just the perfect shade. It's so creamy and it's so pigmented. Okay, and the next two are just two um what is this? Elf lip glosses. And one is from their studio line, and this is a minty lip gloss. And this one is in San Diego, and it's just a corally, kind of like a coral pink peachy color. And I really, this is from their studio line, this is like three dollars. And it, when it says minty lip gloss, it really does smell like straight up mint. It smells so good. Like, oh my gosh, when you smell it, you just want to like lick it or eat it. Like, it smells so good. It smells like candy canes. Oh, it smells so good. I just want to eat it. <laughs> it smells like straight up candy canes or you know those mint patties, whatever they're called. And it just has a sponge tip applicator. And I'm going to do a swatch for you guys. This is like, I don't really do swatches because you guys can't see them anyway. But I really love this. It's actually really quite moisturizing and it's not, um, it's not sticky. It's, it's really, really um, creamy. It make, and it moisturizes your lips too. So this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it's like a holy pink color. And the other one is not from their studio line. This is just from their regular line. And this is like a curly pink lip gloss. Oh, I'm sorry. It's their luscious liquid lipstick. And this one's in baby lip. You guys can even see that as well. Okay, so I'm also really loving my Cleaning for Your Acne Spot Treatment. Um, I'm almost running out, as you see, the packaging is like totally flat. I have to get another one of these. But I've been using this for like a year and it has lasted me for like a year. And I really love this. Um, usually when I get a pimple or if, or if I feel like I'm about to get a breakout, I just um, dab a little bit of this on it and what it does is, it doesn't, um, if it doesn't take it out, if, or if it doesn't stop the pimple from coming immediately, then um, if it doesn't take it out, it just kind of makes it either smaller or decreases the redness. So I always get positive results with this. It either just takes it away or just uh, makes it look better. Okay, so I'm also really loving my Duo Eyelash Glue, and this is in clear white. Um, I love it. This is the best eyelash glue you could ever use. Um, eyelash adhesive. It's the best. No other one will ever top this. It just sticks on so good. So I'm also loving my NYX Mosaic Powder Blush. It's just a pretty pink, different colors of pink. I talked about this a lot, and this one is in rosy. It's really pigmented. I got it from Ulta. And I'm also really loving my e.l.f. liquid eyeliner. And it's very pigmented, and it stays pretty long, too. And it's not waterproof, but I have the other waterproof one. Okay, and I'm also really liking my NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss in tan, which is just a nice beige neutral color. I'm also really liking, I I showed you guys this before, this is the Body Ecology Vanilla Butter Cream, and it's very moisturized, and it smells so good, it smells like straight up vanilla cupcakes. Okay guys, so that's pretty much it, and I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye!